prove it to anybody sitting in this room that he's still a delivering God. Anybody need to be a delivering God tonight? Do you need a miracle? There was a man in the Word of God named Jerry's who had to have a situation turned around that he was told was hopeless. In my mind, I can imagine the doctors probably had been examining his only little girl for some time when they walked over to Jarius and took him into the corner of a house and said, Jarius, we've done everything we can do, but we can't give you any hope for the little girl's life. And in my mind, I see Jarius walking, calling his wife over. He said, honey, I want you to know I've heard about a man. who can open the eyes of the blind. I've heard he's caused the lame to walk and the deaf to hear. And whatever it takes to find the man, I'm going to find him. The Bible says when he found Jesus, he fell at his feet and worshipped him and said, Lord, would you come to my house? My only little girl is dying. Well, Jesus, just looking for anybody to just believe him, said, let's go. Headed off toward the house. And on the way, the messenger stopped him and said, Jerry, there's no need to trouble the master. It's over, your little girl is dead. But you know, when it gets impossible is when Jesus takes over, isn't it? Jesus said, Jarius, don't be afraid. You keep on walking. We're going on to the house. A hand of fear gripped the crowd his home when the doctor shook his head and said she's gone you could feel the mother's heart break you could hear them cry moan. the little girl was only 12 years old but somewhere in the distance outlined against the sun there came a man on a mission from the throne and they said, somebody's coming. But what they did not know, it was a promise coming down that dusty road. There's a promise coming down that dusty road. From his holy hands, healing virtue flows. He's got the key to what you need. Death and hell, he will defeat. Look, for there's a promise coming down that dusty road. Wonder it turned to mocking when Jesus did speak. He said, Your daughter, she's not dead, Jarius, she's just asleep. He turned to the unbelievers and he told them all, Go home. They heard him say, Leave me in death alone. Hallelujah. Then he laid his hand upon the child, he looked death right in the eye. He said, There's a promise coming down 